Okay, this is chapter 7, merry-go-round. In the first part, they want to know what is the velocity. Again, that's distance divided by time, and your distance is 2 pi r. So whatever the radius is times 2 pi. Part B, they want to know the acceleration. Well, the velocity you determined in part A, you have to square that and divide it by the radius, and that will give you the acceleration. And in part C, they give you a new value for radius, and you have to do basically parts A and B over again for the new value. You still use the same time, but the new radius determines both part A and B.